In the episode number 92 of the ASAP Tech News, we talk about the latest NVIDIA graphics card drivers, the Astroc X670e Tai Chi motherboard, a new team group server DDR5 RAM kit, EK Waterblock announces a new water block, and that's about it. We start with NVIDIA and their latest graphics card driver, now at version 516.59. This driver brings out optimizations for the new F1 2022 game, optimizations for Windows 11 22H2, support for the new GeForce GTX 1630 and many more. In terms of fixes, this driver addresses some artifacts present in Red Dead Redemption 2 using AMD Vulkan and black textures in Path of Exile, among many other things. Unfortunately, there are still many issues left unresolved with this release, too many to mention in a single simple news video. As always, I have already installed this driver on my system and nothing new to report, no performance gains and no additional issues present. Next, ASRock has their new X670e Tai Chi motherboard, which has been listed on their website a few days ago. This is the first motherboard that uses the X670 AMD chipset and the new AM5 socket. The information is limited to a single page on the ASRock website, however it does tell us that this motherboard uses a 26-phase VRM system and has only two PCIe Express 5.0 slots, one being x16 while the other being x8. For the network, this motherboard uses the Intel Killer E3100G 2.5GB internet controller and the Killer AX1675X802-11AX Wi-Fi E6 for its Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connectivity. For audio, this board uses the new Realtek ALC4082 audio chipset and more than likely Japan-made filtering capacitors. Other features found on this motherboard include a two-digit post display, onboard power and reset buttons, and a large metal cover that is placed over the entire lower half of the motherboard. Apart from this, the information is scarce, and the pricing is not known. We continue with EK Waterblock, which has announced the new Mana Light block for the MSI MAG Z690 Torpedo motherboard. This is an Intel LGA1700 socket based light block designed to work exclusively with the MSI MAG Z690 Torpedo motherboard. This kit not only includes the water block but also the complete VRM heatsink kit for the motherboard. This way, compatibility is guaranteed with all types of configurations using this motherboard. The water block makes direct contact with the VRM heatsinks of the motherboard through thermal pads and is secured using the standard EK water block mounting system. The base plate of this water block is made from solid nickel plated electrolytic copper, while the top plate is made from clear acrylic. For RGB, the water block has a 3 pin 5 volts addressable DRGB LED strip pre installed. This LED strip is fully compatible with the RGB system of the motherboard. In terms of pricing, the EK water block mana light block has an MSRP of 99.90 euros. And finally, Team Group has announced a high-performance industrial-grade DDR5 RAM kit running at 5600MHz. This new RAM kit is running at the before-mentioned frequency with an operating voltage of 1.1V. What is different with these RAM kits is the fact that these are using the RGB LEDs to showcase error codes and status codes while also having a typical BIOS speaker installed on the side of the PCB. Both features have as their purpose the immediate notification of a functioning error. Error. While good on paper, I fail to understand how these features will work in a server enclosure, especially since a lot of servers have multiple high-speed fans running at maximum RPM 24-7. Only time will tell if these will have any degree of success on the market. And this is the end of the episode number 92 of the ASAP Tech News, one of the few tech news series which aims to deliver you the news as fast as possible for your convenience.